What's good and what's up guys, let's do J here's more. Let's play the Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. In the last episode, Minda was in distress and we had to take her to Princess Zelda. Uh, once we met Zelda, she restored Minda back after helping us figure out our next destination. So in this episode, we're going to go after the blade crafted by the wisdom of the ancient sages. The Blade of Evil's Bane, the Master Sword. Go back here in Farron Woods, you wouldn't come here to North Farron Woods. Hey, it's the monkey from uh, not too long ago. And by not too long ago, I mean like several, several episodes ago. Uh oh. Let's go ahead and help it out. Yeah! Get rid of those puppets. You okay, little monkey? Did... did you save me? Thank you! Listen, since you're so nice, let me tell you something. There's a really pretty wooded area on the other side of, that, of this cliff. I climbed over there, but when I tried to go deeper into the woods, those guys attacked me. What's in those woods anyway? Oh, more than you can comprehend, little monkey. So let's go ahead. So, there's another section of forest beyond this cliff. Alright, Arthur, let's go. Start Minda jumping. Whoa! Jump, jump, jump. Awesome. Got some keys there, but not gonna worry about them. Actually, you know what? Let's take them out. God dang it! Really? It's gonna make me Minda jump again. That's stupid. That's stupid. I won't complain, because that's stupid. I know that only took like two seconds. You know what? I hate you. I hate you so much. Stupid. Whatever, I'm just going to go ahead. Because we don't have the Gale Boomerang, we have to wait for the wind to come and blow these things. What's this? Ha! You're stuck in a wall. That's what you get. Luck it doesn't take too long for the wind to come. So we want to kind of wait. Go, 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 go. Whoop. Come over here. We have yet another Howling Stone. Let teachings of old pass to you. Take sword at hand and find me. So there's the hero shade once more, just outside of Hyrule Castle Town. It was like right over here last time, so we'll be go visit him soon. I don't. I will admit this right now, I don't know like all the songs that you howl as a wolf, but that one is the Prelude Light. Very fitting for this next area. Welcome to the Sacred Grove, one of my absolute favorite areas of this game. I really love the music here. It, let me give you an example. Uh, in Kingdom Hearts, there's a song, Dive to the Heart, which is a fantastic song. There's another uh, song in another game 
uh, same series called My Heart's Descent. Basically the same song, but it's like a little remix, which is fantastic. That's what this is. The, uh, the Sacred Grove is the song of the Lost Wood. Lost Woods. But it's an awesome remix. Anyway, let's go ahead and do this. So now we have these puppy guys to deal with, and that was indeed a skull child. Uh, we need to go out to him. Because maybe he knows something. But yes, as this is the Lost Woods, you can get lost here. It's not that difficult. I believe where we want to go is to. Yep, we want to go over this way. And there we have the skull kid. Attack him. God, I love this song. And it's just so ca- If you're ever in a bad mood, just listen to this song and you will be in a much better mood. It's just that fantastic. I love this remix. Whoop. Uh, let's see. We don't go this way. No, we go this way. It's over here. And that little waterfall over there, we want to go to. Because you can hear him. How you can tell you're close to him is when you hear his little- Will that be Deku pipes going on? No, sir. Yeah. Jump across, and we have these guys to deal with once more. Here's where we've uh, attacked them the first time. Whoop, they get close to attacking. And I believe the way we want to go now is this way. Go away, stupid puppet. He's up there, so we need to walk around a little bit. Now, you know what? Get away from me. Stupid puppet. Luckily, they cannot climb up here, so you're fine. They're down there like, oh, what are we supposed to do? The master calls to attack him. And he's just right over there. And attack. So let's go ahead and follow him down this way. And I believe he went this way. Ah, there he is. So now we go to battle with them. The uh, main thing you want to do here is to get rid of. Oh, you know what? Midna, I'm gonna punch you. God! Die! All right, you want to take out the stupid puppets. Wait for him to go use his daiki pipes and attack. Jeez, I didn't mean to lose my cool like that, but god, that was annoying. Take them out. You do not want to attack him while his puppets are still alive. The reason for that is because uh, he will just teleport away. Oh. I also like the fact that he has uh, the same lantern as the uh, Postals.
Oh, get to him, get to him, get to him. Got him. He <laughs> bye. All right, so a new way has been opened to us. Let's go ahead and go there. All right, so now we're in a very interesting area. Let's go ahead and howl right here. We are the guardians of this land. Guide us to where we once stood. Only then can you enter the true sacred grove. So yes, we have a little bit of a puzzle here. This puzzle can be quite a doozy. Uh, what you want to do is go left. Then you want to go down. You want to go right two times. You want to go up. You want to go right. Oh, wait, let me make sure I'm doing this right. I have a little thing right here next to me, so let's see. Do do. So I go up twice, but wrong. I believe we want to go. Oh, right here's where we want to go up twice. Up twice. Then we want to go left. Down twice. Then we want to go right. And then we want to go up. It's a pretty simple puzzle if you know what you're doing. Go now to the sacred place, beast. We yield passage to the sacred grove. I do, do I do think the little sound they're making as the door is opening. Going, I do think that was a little unnecessary. But anyways, let's go ahead and go up these stairs to the true sacred grove. And there before us lies our prize, the blade of evil's bane. The blade crafted by the wisdom of the goddesses, not the goddesses, the sages. The sword accepts you as his master. <laughs> this thing is the embodiment of the evil magic that Zant casts on you. It's definitely different from our tribe's shadow magic. 
Careful, if you touch it, you'll turn back into a beast. This thing is too dangerous. It's probably best for, it'd probably be for the best if we leave it here, huh? But on the other hand, if we kept it, you'll be able to transform to a beast anytime you wanted. Yes, since Zant was kind enough to give us give this to us, we should be thankful and use it all we can. If you need it, just call me. I want to keep a low profile, so I'll be hiding your shadow when you're human. But I could change you whenever you or I could change you whenever. You could be a wolf anytime you like. Also, thanks to this thing, you could warp anywhere you want by change or by switching into wolf form. Hey, but listen, Arthur, I have a little favor to ask. Would you mind coming with me to find something called the Mirror of Twilight? It's hidden somewhere in Hyrule. Yes, the Mirror of Twilight, our last potential link to Zant. Now that we have the Master Sword, we are also given the ability to warp whenever we want fast travel. That is why I have waited until now to want to do all the side quests. And that's what we'll be doing over the course of the next couple episodes. So, next time on, let's play The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess with Master Sword in hand and with the ability to warp whenever we please. We'll be tackling all the side quests and pieces of heart that I have put off until now. As well as getting uh, all the bugs that I've missed because I believe now uh, we now have access to all of these bugs except for one of them. If memory serves. I want to say that's correct. Uh, I'll probably look that up. But but yes if you are watching this LP mainly for a story, you can skip the next couple of episodes because they'll just be all side quests. Yeah. But once the side quests are done, we'll be looking for the Mirror of Twilight, our last potential link to Zant. I will see you all next time when we begin the uh, string of side quests. And if you're going to be skipping the next couple of episodes, I will see you when you go looking for the Mirror of Twilight. I'll see you all next time.